Welcome. In August 2025, near Camp Atterbury, Indiana, the Pentagon hosted its inaugural Top Drone School, a four-day training event that brought drone operators, industry teams, and academia together in a realistic, threat-oriented environment. Today, we'll walk through what the school was, why it matters, and what it points to for the future of unmanned systems. The event took place at the Muscatatuck Training Center just south of Camp Atterbury as part of the semi-annual T-Rex Technology Readiness Experimentation Showcase. Service members, industry teams, and academic participants flew drones in a terrain built to simulate urban threats. The training emphasized maneuverability, endurance, and reconnaissance in challenging terrain. Drone types ranged from untethered first-person view systems to fiber-optic connected drones. The Pentagon is building more than just new drones. It is building the training and organizational architecture to make them effective. According to the commander of the Rapid Assessment or Prototype Technology Task Force, Latin Coalition Matt Limeberry, the school carries a dual purpose, capturing rich data for future capabilities and sharpening warfighter skills under threat-informed conditions. Leadership is calling this part of a push toward what Defense Secretary Pete Hegseth described as drone dominance. In short, it's not only about the airframe but about the operator, the tactic, and the context. The inaugural school is scheduled to be repeated. The Pentagon plans at least two such events per year. Future courses will raise the complexity, denser wooded terrain, simulated electronic warfare and jamming threats, multi-week durations, key takeaways, Training under realistic threat emulation improves operator readiness. Drones increasingly operate in contested environments. Skill matters. Systemic change. Infrastructure. Tactics. Acquisition all have to adapt. One analyst put it this way. The goal is to fly with and through the adversary effects to stay competitive. As unmanned systems become more central to military operations, initiatives like the Top Drone School show how training is becoming just as important as the hardware. The inaugural event marks a shift from acquisition of platforms to integration of platforms, operators and tactics in real-world contexts. Thanks for watching. If you found this insightful, hit the like button, subscribe for future coverage of unmanned systems and defense training and leave your thoughts in the comments. How do you see drone training evolving over the next decade? Until next time, stay informed and stay curious.